hotties and welcome back to my channel. So I have some quick little Halloween things that I wanted to share with you guys because I'm in the middle of decorating. But before we begin, let me remind you that subscribing is 100% free. So please click that subscribe button. And while you're at it, go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that I post. I post every single week, sometimes even multiple times a week. So trust me, you don't want to miss out. Alrighty, so let's move on to the first item. And I have to say, it kind of gets progressively better. So there's a little sneak peek. Oop, oop. All right. <laughs> so the first item um, are these Hershey's Cookies and Cream Fangs. This is actually part of my gift for my siblings. They love the Cookies and Cream Hershey's bars. So I found these and it just so happened to be Halloween themed. So I thought it was cute. I've never seen this before. Little fangs. So I got two bags and then in my previous Halloween videos, then you know my obsession with the Halloween Oreos. They're the best Oreos. For some reason, they just they, they taste the best out of every other Oreo. Um, and it's not like it's like a special cream or anything. It's literally like the regular flavor. It's just the color. I don't know what it is, but it just it tastes amazing. And they have, of course, all of our characters on the back. So can't wait to dig into those. And then let's see, these, oh, this is uh, a chalk writer. So I do have a Halloween decoration that I needed chalk for and uh, I didn't have it last year. So I decided to just get this little chalk writer from Dollar Tree. And next we have creepy cloth. I have never decorated with creepy cloth before and this year I was determined because every year I was like, oh, I'll get creepy cloth this year, but I never end up getting it. And also I kind of wasn't sure if it would just look too messy, but I mean, it's Halloween, you know, so you kind of have to have creepy cloth. So I got creepy cloth. This is actually pretty big, like the length. So I wasn't sure about the length, if it was too big, but I was like, I mean, I can always cut it to size if I need to. So they're about three bucks and I got, I think five of them. Yeah, five of them. So I can't wait to use these. And then we have some straws, some Halloween paper straws, also from Walmart. They were 98 cents. And I thought I could use them for Halloween spooky drinks as well as for my tiered trays. So here we have those. And then, oh my gosh, <laughs> you guys. Uh, in their Halloween section, they had these little plushies. And for the longest time, I have been wanting Squishmallows, but I can never seem to find them. They're always like sold out in all my stores that sell them. So these were the next best thing, but they were just, they were too adorable. I think there is one Squishmallow in the same section, but these were actually cuter. So the first one is a black cat with green eyes. I'm not really a cat person, but I've always said if I did ever have a cat, it would be a black cat with green eyes. And this is it, perfection. And these are, let's see, 574 in case you're wondering. And I saw this guy right next to him, this little purple bat, how cute. If this isn't the cutest bat I've ever seen, oh my gosh. And I just love the purple. Purple is one of my all-time favorite colors. And I decorate for Halloween with purple and green and black and orange. So this was perfect. And next we have this Libra cup, which is actually for my sister. It's Ray Dunn, which she's not a big fan of Ray Dunn, but she loves black and gold. That color combo is just her favorite aesthetic. So there's a, uh, it says Libra on the front and it has the constellation on the back and she's actually already seen it and she loved it. So I haven't given it to her yet. I FaceTimed her, but she said she loved it. So I got it for her. And this is actually from Home Goods. And then my Starbucks cup. I have an obsession with Starbucks cups. I don't know why. Um, I have two of them already. Here, I'll show you. I'm currently using two of them <laughs> for my water. I have two tumblers that look like this. Um, one is green, of course. The other one is this peachy color. And as you can see, they're not spiked. They're like this really, really pretty, like gemstone looking version. So I was really excited to get my first uh, spiky Starbucks tumbler. Um, it's not the most comfortable to hold in your hand because obviously the spikes, but it is so pretty. It looks so Halloween-y. Halloween-y, is that a word? Uh, I think so. But I just love the shininess. I don't know, it's not glitter. It's like pearlized finish of the Starbucks cup and it's so pretty. Let's see. 
And this was oh, $22.95. I think the other ones that I've gotten were all like $19.95. This one was a little bit more expensive, but it's just, this is going to be my water cup for all of spooky season. And next we have this backpack, which is also a gift for my sister, but it was so cool that I thought I would share it with you guys. It actually comes with a backpack, of course, but also this little case for your AirPods and a wallet. So if you're in the market for a little book bag or you know anything, she actually wanted a bag to carry her iPad. So this was perfect. And it also has interchangeable like charms. So there's the bow or the little tassel. So she can just, you know, whatever she's feeling that day, she can change it. And it's actually very spacious. I would open it, but it has the rest of their gifts in there. The only thing about this backpack though, is that it had a weird smell. Like it's not a plastic smell. It's a fish smell. I don't know why it smelled like fish. It was brand new. Uh, like all the packaging, everything is, is brand new when um, I unwrapped it. So I don't know why it had like a fish smell to it. Uh, yeah, so needless to say, I Lysoled the heck out of it. And I have some dryer sheets stuffed in here. So um, hopefully that'll help. Uh, let me give you a little close up. It has a little front pocket. It has side pockets. It has a pocket on the inside as well. And I just love how it has this gunmetal hardware, which I don't see that often. And I know my sister, she she loves anything dark. She has a very dark aesthetic. So um, yeah, I know she'll love it. Now let's go over here. I got this super cool villains t-shirt from the Dollar Tree actually, which I had never seen Dollar Tree selling t-shirts um, until well, this, this day. <laughs> so uh, I, of course, had to get it because if you've seen any of my previous videos, then you know my absolute obsession with Disney villains. Um, this was, let's see, I don't think it was a dollar. Oh yeah, five bucks. It was five bucks. So there's that. And then I heard that Burlington Coat Factory had Halloween pajamas and I had been wanting Halloween pajamas for I don't even know how many years now. And I finally got some. That's right. <laughs> I have them all laid out so it would be um, quicker and fat, easier to show you guys. So this is the first pair. It's so adorable, I love it. And these actually were my favorite. I couldn't decide between these three. <sighs> and so, um, you know, whenever I have that problem, I use my problem solving skills and just end up buying all of it. So anyways, <laughs> this is the first pair. Um, it is so soft it literally feels like you're wearing nothing and it came with shorts which i love so there's that and i love the style of this it looks so like i don't know it has like a little collar and everything and buttons it's just so adorable and the next one looks just like that but of course we have our white ghosties super duper cute and this also came with shorts right here um i just love their faces look at this one look how happy he is and of course the same style with the collar and the little buttons. And this one actually has a little, oh my gosh, that one has a pocket too. I didn't even notice that, wow. Okay, well both of them has pockets. Um, these shorts, however, they're not as comfortable as that one. They are comfortable, but this kind of lining, this piping that they have on the shorts kind of scratches at your, like the back of my thighs, I, I guess. And it's not the most comfortable, but the material overall is super duper comfortable. It's the same material as that one. So very, very nice. If I were to choose as far as comfort goes, I would definitely choose that one. Anyways, our final pajamas. I really love the print of it. And I asked my siblings and my husband and they all loved this one the most out of the three. And uh, the only thing was it came with pants, which I love pants, don't get me wrong, but these are like capri pants. So they stop a couple of inches above my ankle I don't know. It, it just, uh, it's not my thing. I'd rather have like full pants or shorts, <laughs> but um, I don't know. My husband said it looked very adorable, but after I tried all of them on, he did end up liking that the best. <sighs> Anyways, this one is super adorable and super comfortable. It has the collar and the little pocket and then my little capri pants. And this one says, oh, MSRP for $42. And this was actually $14.99. So that's great. 
So I have my Halloween PJs. All right, my pretties. I hope you guys enjoyed my little Halloween haul. I'm going to have another exciting video soon on my channel. So please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.